All right, Susan Hobbs here, brought to you by Pet Pals TV, joined by Samantha Morton, the Indiana representative for the Humane Society of the United States, and uh, welcome to both of you as well. Who, who's this? What do we got here? This is Bo. Okay. Uh, Bo is a 16-year-old uh, rescue dog. Really? He was on death row at Indianapolis Animal Care Services and was uh, rescued by Natalie's Second Chance Dog Rescue, and he's just celebrated his 16th birthday back wow. in November. Oh. So, oh. so, yeah. He's, he's, he's our... Like the jacket. Oh, yeah. yeah, he's our Valentine today, he, since okay. we've got Valentine's Day tomorrow. Yeah, I like yeah. that. Yeah. That's good stuff right there. But one of the things, one of the first things I want to mention is Humane Society of the United States. People get that really confused yeah, with... Yeah, what is that? Well, they get it confused with, like, the Humane Society of Indianapolis. Right. HSUS, Humane Society of the United States, is not an overarching umbrella organization. It's more of a legislative branch. It's a... Uh, autonomous it's its own legislative uh, entity yes. yeah how does that work yes that's correct so um, the Humane Society of the United States is the nation's most effective animal protection organization we take on um, the biggest fights for animals to end suffering for all animals so we take on fights against puppy mills um, ending uh, trophy uh, fighting um, or against animals and then we also um, work on things like ending cosmetic testing for on dogs and cats as well. So okay. we, we really take on a variety of issues and we, we work to change the laws um, that make it better for animals um, and th and that's within a, our state and across the country. Th across the country, right? Yes. I mean, that's the, uh -huh. the bigger thing right here. And so it's different from just the Humane Society here in Indiana. Right, there, there, there's no um, shelter. This is more of a legislative branch. They, mm -hmm. they go into our uh, legislatures and mm -hmm. try to enact laws which right now you guys are working with a case down in Charlestown, wildlife in need. That's correct. And we've got, we've got some pictures, um, and they don't really reflect the condition of, of the animals now. The condition of, of the animals I've seen is pretty grisly, so I've chosen not to show those. Yes. But um, tell us a little bit about wildlife in need and, and what is happening. Yes, so Wildlife in Need is um, a, a nonprofit sanctuary down in Charleston Town, Indiana, that's run into some issues with um, the USDA. Recently, the USDA uh, revoked um, Tim Stark's license, and there's been some severe um, allegations of uh, violations of the Animal Welfare Act, um, and there's been a lot of uh, allegations of abuse and neglect, um, ways that animals have been euthanized um, in inhumane ways, and actually recently the Indiana Attorney General's office just filed a lawsuit um, to seek to dissolve the nonprofit corporation and to rescue the animals. Mm. Well and one of the things that we were talking about is uh, contact with with the public that I, I guess Wildlife in Need has mm -hmm. baby tigers or has had baby tigers and yes. you, can, you can go there and have your picture taken with a baby tiger. That's what it is. Yep. Okay. Yeah, But you were telling me that they declaw these babies and just kind of do not healthy things with them to, to make them more appropriate, appropriate. It's more animal abuse yes. going on, more yeah. than likely in these wildlife. Yes, so. Exactly. And right now HSUS is um, kind of consulting with the state as yes. to how to move forward with this. That's exactly Aww. right. We're hoping that the best outcome for the animals is really the goal here. Yeah. Good stuff as well. All right, uh, I know you cover a lot of this on Pet Pals. We do. And that'll be coming up on... Uh, Saturday. There you go, 10.30 yeah. a.m. right here, right here on Wish TV. Exactly. You can also get more information by going to PetPalsTV.com, uh, and you can follow Pet Pals, of course, TV. Contact your legislator. Contact your legislator. This little one right here is just chilling out. 16 years old? Yes. Yeah, yeah he is. Yeah, he doesn't look a day over 11, no. does he? No. He's a good boy. Cutie. Yeah. Cutie. Oh, He's found his, his good out. home. Right. Yeah, <laughs> that's right. His little safe spot as well. Uh, Samantha Susan, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. Yeah, thanks for having us. All right, Randy.